Ciao da Svide, ci troviamo su Siberia 3, vai con la intro e poi si gioca. Who's the master in game? It's video game, darling, who has the coolest name? It's video game. Allora ragazzi, vediamo un po' di andare verso di lì e vediamo che cosa troviamo. Uh. Attenzione. Sembra ci sia una specie di molo lì. C'è qualcuno di là? Io direi di andare là dove c'è vita. Corriamo là. Allora. C'è qualcuno? Salve. Believe me, it's a really good thing that the nomads can't just come and go around Valsambor as they please anymore. Okay. That big boat, the crystal, Grande nave, has been nave rotting at the dock for years. In Porto da anni. I can't understand why that gutless oboe keeps trying to maintain his rotten tongue. Non riesco a capire perché il video oboe cura la manutenzione della sua bagnarola. La situazione è calda per il sindaco Buclé. Incastro Vediamo qua We're going to see the Nomad Souk Apparently they have good prices Since the town hall closed the port We sometimes get the impression we're living in a ghost town Va bene Chi? Porte chiuse nelle avventure troveremo sempre porte chiuse. Vediamo pescatore, proviamo a sentire. Hi there. Anything biting? Bocca qualcosa? Massive. Magari negli ultimi vent'anni ci sono sempre meno pesci. Chissà perché è davvero strano. You seem to know the region well. Sembra conoscere bene la regione, forse può aiutarmi. Mi piacerebbe sapere di più sulle leggende locali. Mi hanno detto che c'è una specie di mostro che vive in fondo al lago. Non è una leggenda. Come puoi essere così sicuro? Prima, quando il lago ghiacciava molto prima, durante la stagione, la gente faceva fuori nel ghiaccio in mezzo al lago per pescare così. A volte montava capanne per l'inverno proprio vicino al foro. I vecchi dicevano che il foro doveva essere piccolo, abbastanza largo da far passare un pesce quando lo acchiappavi. Non più di così. Un giorno un ragazzo diverso dagli altri fece un foro molto grande perché era più comodo, disse. Nel caso avesse preso un pesce più grosso. E poi, beh, non deve credermi, ma fu lui a finire nel foro, all'indietro, nelle profondità ghiacciate. Men che non si dica, il braccio del mostro uscì dal buco, afferrò il povero ragazzo e lo trascinò in fondo al lago. Ecco perché i vecchi non fanno mai un foro grande nel ghiaccio, a causa del mostro che si cela là sotto. Come sa tutto questo? Perché il povero ragazzo era mio fratello maggiore, io pescavo proprio accanto a lui quel giorno, pensi un po'. Buona giornata signorina. Ma che storia. Parla ancora? È per il monster del lago che le cose sono chiuse. Andiamo di qua. Si può salire sulla nave di qua, forse? Allora, qui c'è qualcuno. Mmm. Ehi te! Eh, un po' ubriaco o no? Oh! Va tutto bene? Va tutto bene? Sei ok, signor? Un altro step e tu eri nel drink! A-I-N-O! Pardon? È me, Capitano Obo! 
Obo. Obo. Proud commander of the... Yep, just this proud crystal. So don't you, sir, me. Well, siamo a posto, il comandante quello lì. Captain, I'm Kate Walker. I'm looking for Steiners, the clockmaker. If I fall in the water, Taylor, it'll be to go straight to hell. So don't... Don't fall in the water, Sail. You understand? Bastard's waiting for me. Who are you talking about? The monster of the lake is waiting for us all, miss. Mm. Uh, che lui parla del mostro del lago. Everyone's time comes eventually. To finish the work. Come on. Back in the fight. Because you can never lower your guard. Never. Andiamo a salire. Allora. Dunque lì si può entrare lì della cabina. Se no guardiamo un po'. Ah, anche lì si può andare. Anche in alto. No, non guardi. La crystal. Non è quella la nave di cui sta parlando lì earlier? a quel porto? Eh sì. Deserted as the outside. Abbandonato con esterni. Given the number of seats, this must be some kind of ferry, some kind of transport. Ho perlustrato tutta la nave, ma era veramente completamente deserta. Ho provato a guardare un po' dappertutto, ma proprio non c'era un'anima viva. Secondo me sulla nave bisogna andarci in un secondo momento, quindi andiamo vedere di qua lì c'è una macchina ah lì c'è uno che dorme svegliamolo no dorme troppo profondamente vediamo un tremo qua I'd rather be left here on my own if you don't mind. Yeah, we can't always. Beh, loro che casino fate? Parlate tutti insieme. Excuse me, please, miss. Yes, I'm looking for Simon Steiner. Simon Steiner is my grandfather. My name is Sarah. Sarah Steiner. Bene. Pleased to meet you, Sarah. I'm Kate Walker. Can you tell me where I can find your grandfather's workshop? Of course. You'll find his shop is at the end of the alleyway, on the left, just as you leave it, in the main avenue. Can I ask what you want with him? Because he's rather old, you know. I'm accompanying the Yukul caravan. Apparently your grandfather is supposed to be making a mechanical prosthesis for Kirk, their spiritual chief, who had a bad accident recently. Without the artificial leg, Kirk won't be able to go along with the great migration of his people. And on top of that, the Yukuls won't leave without their guide. You're accompanying the Yukuls? My god, you're so terribly lucky. When I was little, grandfather used to tell me all about their adventures, full of mystery and magic. Yukuls. You seem to like the Yukuls, Sarah. I get the impression that's rare in Valsambor. It's true that when it comes to the Yukuls, people around here can be a bit silly. They go out of their way to make the nomad scapegoats for all of the town's problems since they got stuck here. But you don't, do you? Of course not. Grandfather told me that he has actually seen three or four of the great ostrich migrations in his lifetime, and he always really respected those strange people. He even made sure I would admire them too, you know. Sara? Do you like life in Valsambor? Oh, there's really not that much to talk about here, you know. I spend all my time here or with Grandfather since he got sick. Mm -hmm. There was no one who could keep an eye on him for you? 
We can't afford it, I'm afraid. I also think I prefer it this way. My grandfather is my only family. Simon? I guess you're pretty close to your grandfather? Yes. Of course he can get a bit grumpy. Especially the last few years. But he's actually really adorable. And you should see the work he does. Give him a few cogs and springs and he'll give you some unbelievably incredible invention. He mm -hmm. almost makes mechanical objects seem alive. I see exactly what you mean. I used to know someone like that, too. Mm -hmm. The only problem we have is that business collapsed when he got sick. I really do believe that if I didn't have the waitressing jobs to make ends meet, we'd probably have to close up shop. Thank you for your help. I'll be stopping in to see Grandfather on my next break. Maybe I'll see you there. Yes, I hope so. Goodbye, Sarah. Grazie, Sara. Sentiamo anche il barman. Ah, miss, delighted to see that you finally managed to leave the Yuko camp. Yes, thank you very much for the pass. Well, passare. now that you're at last here, you'll be able to taste my famous borscht. It would be my pleasure, but I do have to find Steiner the clockmaker right away. Simon Steiner? Ah, in that case, you should speak with Sarah, our young waitress. Sì, si, si She's his granddaughter. Is Simon Steiner well known here in Balsambourg? For a long time, he was rather popular. You know, he isn't just a clockmaker. He knows everything about mechanical objects. He repaired everything for everybody here in Balsambourg. Mm -hmm. He also designed the amusement park on the other side of the lake with a colleague of his. A French automaton creator, if I remember right. You could say, Valsambor owes a lot to Simon Steiner, miss. So when he got sick, I offered to hire Sarah to help a little. You understand? Chat. Capitano Obo. I met that man recently. A certain Captain Obo. He doesn't mm -hmm. seem very with it. And he's been that way for 20 years, miss. 20 years. Can you imagine? He used to command the crystal. The boat that made the crossing between here and the amusement park. On the other side of the lake. And he wasn't the same man then. Valsambor? How are things in town? They don't seem to be going that well. If you ask me, the atmosphere is horrible. At least half the people don't want the U-calls right at our door. Most of the shopkeepers even made the decision to go on strike over what they saw as unfair competition. Also, Valsambor hasn't been the same in the last 20 years. There it is. I'm off. Thank you again for your help. See you soon, miss. Captain Obo's got it real bad today. Poor old bastard. I hope you find the tavern agreeable, miss. We're pretty lucky with all we've been through. At least we've still got places like this. Parliamo un po' con tutti. All those youngsters trying to act smart to impress the Steiner girl. It really gets to me. <laughs> I'm not standing here because I'm happy, you know, miss. Ah, well being. <laughs> <ride> si è spostato Romino Aspetta Guarda Guardate Guardate come lo sposto <ride> Ma dai Oh Oh <ride> Ma dai <ride> Vabbè Allora Parliamo con questa The lake is haunted by a demon Ah It's watching me. Waiting. I can Mama feel mia. it. It's been hard to sell our produce since the port closed. And now those nomads show up and undercut us. There's something about those nomads at our doors they're not telling us. Ah, il quadro. That shape there in the water. L'ombra là nell'acqua cos'è? È il mostro, è il mostro, è il mostro. Uh, ta, ta, ta. È scomparso. Ah no, riappare là. C'è qualcosa ancora qua? O oh, usciamo? Proviamo a vedere di qua. No, vabbè, possiamo uscire. A sinistra ha detto. In fondo a sinistra ha detto. 
Va bene, questo episodio finisce qui e la prossima volta andremo dall'orologiaio Steiner. Ciao da Svideo!